It's getting tight. When Wayne Toggle, here on the right, went to barber school 25 years ago, his brother's high school teammates reaped the benefits. I used to take his clippers and when before practice I would cut all the players' hair on my basketball team. Bradley Tuggle was soon not just cutting hair professionally, but demonstrating his skills at professional conventions that have the vibe of a rock concert when everything changed for him. I was doing a hair show and a man named Farouk Shami, who owns Chi Hair Care, asked for me to take a ride with him in his limousine to the airport. Farouk offered Bradley a job representing Chi Hair Care, a company whose products he believes in. I wouldn't sell it if I didn't believe in it. But more so, their dedication to combating the COVID pandemic. They have completely switched all shampoo manufacturing over to um, hand sanitizer. Bradley has been able to take his story to a nationwide audience on the various home shopping networks. And like with this, we always at the end comb through it just to show how good it's going to look. And he's become something of a hairstyling celebrity. I've been in airports before. Yeah, Connor. Okay. All right. It's a notoriety he could easily have used to take his salon to one of the country's biggest cities, but he stays in the triad because he believes in his staff. I would put this group of stylists up against anybody. A staff whose chairs, he says, have been empty for far too long. It's time. It's time. I mean, we've sat out a month or so, two months. We followed the rules and hairdressers are a little bit of rebels at the end of the day. And, you know, we're ready to get back to work. Keeping their workplace sanitary has never been an issue in this heavily regulated industry. A hairdresser has been sanitizing from day one, so we know how to handle this situation. And it's a situation that, for some, may be becoming dire. Open hair salons because you don't want to go too long and have these ladies gray roots showing. Bob Buckley. We love doing hair and we want to get back to we want to get back behind the chair as soon as possible. Fox 8 News.